Hi. Oh. Hi. Welcome back to the cleavage corner. That's what I'm gonna call this for now on because y'all seem to like cleavage. But I'm here to teach you how to accentuate all of your cleavages. We can accentuate your elbow cleavage, finger cleavage. We get creative here. Is your shirt off? It should be. Let me so fix it. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna lower our shirts like so. This is Olga, this is Helga. Let's push these little puppies up. They're beautiful and they like to be shown. So can you see that? There you go. So what we're gonna do with this is we're gonna just cover up all the pores. We're just gonna put a little bit of this on the apples, as I like to call them, or the pears, it just depends. Whatever your shape is, it's beautiful, girls. Poreless boobies are ideal. Now that we have those primped and primed, so what I have right here, can you see that? Okay, so we're gonna dip into milk chocolate, chocolate au lait. I speak French sometimes. And so we're just gonna put this right on the crevices, as I call them. If you wanna poke it a little bit, you can do that. We're all sisters here. So we're just slowly building up a natural hint of some definition right there. So what we're all about here in the cleavage corner is we're about everything looking as natural as can be, but catching your eye. We are creating little rainbows. There's no such thing as mistakes, only happy accidents. Next, I'm gonna go dip into espresso. Es espresso. And then what we're gonna do this time is we're gonna take it a little more up higher onto the peaks of them. That's some contour. We are gonna get there, sisters. All right, now that we have finished doing the cream contour on our puppies, we're gonna go in with the Jaclyn Hill palette. We all love this palette. So I'm gonna open this up like so, like that. Okay, copy me. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take that same brush that we used to cream contour with, but once I find it, then we will use that brush. Found it. And we're gonna go in with, I am not sure the names of these. That one, we're gonna go with that one right there. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna put a matte shade on top of this. All right, as you can see, there's a little more definition. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this brush right here. It's a highlighting brush, but we're gonna use it to blend. And we're just gonna blend this out like so. That is working. What I like to do is I like to take this lip and hand polish. It actually works to polish them and make them look a little more shiny, smooth, and just pop a little more. So we're gonna add just a little bit of this. This is vanilla bean flavor. And just add it like so right on the cherries. And I'm gonna do a lighter color. We're gonna go with vanilla, vanilla. And we're gonna put that all on the cherries. And we're just gonna continue adding this to our arches. That's right. And then we're gonna take that same shade, vanilla, and we're gonna put that all in the middle right here. Perfect. All right, this is the completed look. But if you're like me and you're a little extra, you wanna add something to make it pop a little more, a little more zing to it, I have some helpful tricks to do. And I'm warning you, they're a little bit extra, but they will make the look so much more. Uh, this is called glitter. Basically what we're doing is we're adding eyebrow arches to this. I'm making these brows on fleek. Totally looks like the sun just kissed them. Oh, here it is. This is called the Sahara Gold. It's an eye crayon, but we're gonna use it for the eyes of these. This brush again, and blend it all out. Like so. All right, these are the finished girls right here. This is my summer sun-kissed cleavage. And we are ready to just own the day, girls. Crevices. 